Hi, today's video regarding Canon Pixima TR4500 series printer. I'm going to show you how to do the Wi Fi direct setup or how to use the inbuilt Wi Fi system of this printer to do printing and scanning wirelessly. Now, first step is to switch on the printer and press the setting button on the display panel. Now, look for device setting option, click OK. Look for LAN setting and click OK again. Here, scroll next and look for wireless direct click on that now we need to switch it on so click ok again and enable wireless direct yes so you click ok now it's done and now we need to know the password so click next here and look for the security option that is security protocol and click ok and do we want to display it yes and here you see it says the password so write down this password as we need to use it when we are connecting the printers Wi-Fi with our Android or iPhone device now download the Canon print app in your uh, device and then open the Wi-Fi setting so that we can look for the printers name now once you open it you will see it says direct TR4500 series printer now once you click on that it will ask the password now you can enter the password you have written and this will take some time so you just have to keep patience and once you enter the password click on the connect button so as you can see here now your phone will not have any internet connection because this is the uh, Wi-Fi system of your printer so now open the Canon print app we have to add the printer there so it will ask you the permission if not then you can click on the printer icon at the bottom and it will search and add the printer automatically and just keep this connection so confirm that you are using this connection here and in the final you will see this screen so your printer is added and now you can use it for the wireless printing and scanning as you can see the printer is showing up there and it also shows how, how much ink is left and even if you want you can check more details there are scan and copy option copy actually doesn't work because you have to do directly from the printer so it's good for the wireless printing and scanning now if you don't have enough ink you can click on that it will take you a site where you can buy that and here you can also check the more details about this printer Thanks for watching.